their words were carried by the attic wind as they exposed their thoughts to worm and many upon the matters that did weigh their mind and many trifling things that made them weep. Some of these words flew to the temple sacred where great Athena stood in high distinction and others on their ears alone were wasted and in deaf minds did find a bleak extinction. But Pericles stood here and spoke a dream that made it past not only place but time, that reached across the seas of depth extreme, and finds itself now even in this rhyme. For he that felt a man of greatest beauty, and to redream his dream remains my duty.